there were a few requests from my viewers to how to check 90th percentile 95th and 99th percentile in J meter and there are a few requests on how to add the aggregate report using J meter as well so today I'm going to show you how to add an aggregate report and where we can find the 90th, 99th or 95th percentile data being captured in JMeter. Along with that, I'll explain all the sections of aggregate report so that you can make use of it in a most optimal way. So first, to add aggregate report, I've just configured one simple uh, sample HTTP request and one view result uh, view result tree which basically shows us the request and what response we received from the server so step one for adding a aggregate report go to add go to listener and select aggregate report here so post that you will see all these sections under the aggregate report the samples section will show us the requests and how many number of requests that are being sent to the server so in my case I see here I have a number of threads 2 and loop count 10 so 2 into 10 20 requests will be shown under samples average is the average time taken for getting a response from the server so let's say I have 100 requests and I got responses in 1 second 2 seconds 3 second till 100 seconds for all my requests so now it will be 1 plus 2 plus 3 till 100 divided by 100 a simple average calculation the next one is median median is basically where does your let's say it's more or less like a 15th percentile like high half of the requests are below this uh, number let's say let's take the same example as of the last one all my responses 100 responses have taken one two three four seconds till 100 second and then uh, the median will be somewhere around 50 and then the 90th percentile 90th percentile or 95th or 99th percentile basically it eliminates that percentage of the worst requests responses times so let's say take the same case I have got responses from one second second request two second third request three second Likewise, I have got, got the response times till 100 seconds. So when I go to 90th percentile, it will eliminate the top 10 worst response times. That is 91 seconds, 92, 93, 93, 100 seconds. It will eliminate and give me 90 seconds. So 10% of the worst requests were eliminated. This is just to give a benefit of doubt uh, or you can say um, some window to uh, you know the errors that might have happened during the execution similarly 95th percentile is 95 percent of your requests were responded below this number of seconds 99th percentile is also similar minimum and maximum well understandable the lowest number of seconds or lowest time taken for the whole set of requests I mean let's say the 10th request was, was responded in point you know 5 seconds or 500 milliseconds so your minimum is 500 milliseconds maximum is maximum time taken by any of your requests in the whole set error percentage if there is a response which uh, which is a error response from the server that percentage is calculated under error percentage throughput is basically number of requests processed for a time unit etc 
minutes say per minute or per second how many number of requests are processed received kb and sent kb are part of throughput and it's calculated in kb kilobytes and per second that's you know exchange between the server and the load generators so let me run this if i run this request and keep an eye on the aggregate report yeah so it will start capturing the data once the execution starts currently i am saying one sample it will process till 20 samples and give us all this data suppose that you know different organizations follow different standards some organizations say that they should consider the 90th percentile for their reporting for fixing for different type of things some people say 95th percentile some people prefer to be more correct and say 99th percentile should be uh, uh, below two seconds one second 500 milliseconds kind of so based on your requirement you can get this to an excel set and report it to the stakeholders and make sure you point out if there is any response time which is going beyond the allowed limit so this is taking some time to get complete here okay now we are at 12 requests which are already processed it will continue till 20 and then you will be able to see the complete report so hope uh, i have made the aggregate report part of jmeter clear to all of you thanks a lot for watching